play artist Nora Jones. Please repeat. Play artist Nora Jones. Please repeat. Okay, I, pl I play the same f***ing song every night. Nora f***ing Jones. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta be fresh. Hey, Alice, is there any purple stuff in there? Because I'm just trying to get my blood sugar back in sync. Oh, wow. Congrats, Anders. That's no big deal. You know what, everybody? Let's give Anders a standing ovation, huh? You know what? I'm gonna have this fiber yogurt. Why don't we all clap for me too, huh? Come on. Moron. Gotta be fresh. Sweetie, I'm gonna be working late tonight. I have an international conference call. Brussels. Oh, home of John claude Van Damme. Muscles from Brussels. Shut up. That's what they call them. So there's some frozen calzones in the freezer, and um, I'll be home later. Ugh, I'm tired of being cooped up in your stupid widow pen. <laughs> Bradley, I told you I am not a widow, okay? I am divorced. I am an independent woman in the prime of my life. You're 35 and alone. I run train on chicks like you. Oh my God. Why don't I hang with these nerds? What? Okay. No, no, Bradley, you do not want to hang out with them, okay? They are total losers. Real losers? Come on, we have a swimming pool. We. We all have our own rooms. We have an aquarium, a very small one. We have two working toilets. That's mm -hmm. not very loser, is it? It's settled then. Yeah, be right. All right. Woo -hoo. <whistles> I'll be right back. That dude definitely looks at porn. It's funny because it's true. He does. Yeah. I've caught him. OK, listen to me. Bradley is my brother and the only thing in the world that I love. He's like the child I will never have. So I want you to go against every instinct you may have tonight and not do anything stupid. Roger that. Yeah, because if you don't bring him back safe and sound, I'm gonna eat your balls for breakfast tomorrow with my grape nuts. Then I'm gonna murder you. Then I'm gonna fire you. Okay, have fun. She just put the fear of God into my boner. Gotta be fresh. Hey. What do you want? I just want to let you know that you're not alone. We're here for you. I'm here for you. Have you made any sales today? Ooh, you are angry. I like that. I, if I got divorced, I'd probably be pretty angry too. First, I'd have to get married, but then if uh, I'd get divorced. You need to get back on the man horse, right? Because I think I know a certain horse man that might want to take you out for a trot. Are you seriously hitting on me right now? Nay! No, I'm not. That was my horse impression saying no. I just want to know what kind of dudes are you into? These. I want a hot as balls male model. Are you online dating? I need to hire a model for the company website, you dummy. Is that right? So. Gotta be fresh. Excuse me, you guys haven't sold one whistle? Okay, you know what? Stop effing around and get back on the phones now. Look, I don't want to offend you or diss you by saying what I'm about to say, but your dad's smoke cutters blow ass. If I shit in a tin cup, you should be able to sell it. We could probably sell that a little easier because of like fetish sites and stuff. Yeah. People are freaks, Alice. Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I'll take one. Okay, look. I'm sorry, but I need you guys to sell these, okay? Because my dad has been driving me crazy about giving him grandkids. So to get him off my ass, I said, why don't you take a business class, invent something? Then he sunk his life freaking savings into these stupid whistles. So we have to sell them, or I gotta find a hubby and shoot a pup out my hoo-hoo. I hear you loud and clear. <laughs> oh, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> this place is elaborate. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Let me uh, saddle up next to you and let you know that my intentions with your daughter have been and always will be pure. Hi, I'm Adam. You two are dating? Oh. <laughs> yes, in a very significant way. It started off purely physical, but then it got emotional, and then it went back to physical. But my intentions are pure. I want you to know that. <laughs> they, they are. are. <laughs> they are. <laughs> they yeah, are. Yeah. Adam and I are <sighs> dating. Anyway, but I wanted to tell you the, the boys are like, Super excited to sell Ooh. your smoke cutters, Ooh, aren't you nice guys? Soul. Yeah. Get down to it. How many you sold? A dozen? 
Two dozen? Zero. Zero for now, but we are going to call in a very wonderful sales consultant and just see if he can't work some magic for us, right, oh, yeah. guys? And he will. I mean, we were just talking about how fantastic this smoke cutter product oh, yeah. is. Yeah. It's the second most fantastic thing you've created. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the first being Alice. You guys got that, right? We got it. Yeah, no, okay, we totally good. got it. Gotta be fresh. It just feels natural, doesn't it? Okay, just, mm. Adam, please just chill out, okay? We okay. are just faking it for a couple of more days until he leaves, all right? Yeah, but, you know, we might fake it so hard that it ends up becoming real, you know? Did someone order Italian trio Sammy's, chicken Caesar salads, and cherry Coke zeros? I did! <laughs> <laughs> I know my little girl. All yeah, right. <laughs> Sweetheart, listen, next time your mom is in town, we have got to make reservations at this new restaurant that Adam told her about. It's so good. It's this little Italian bistro. Wait, Adam was telling mom? What? Oh, yeah. We've been feisty, Ken. I think you guys should actually come out during Thanksgiving. You guys could stay in Durs's room, Blake's room. Hopefully, we'll be in nursery by that point. Wait a minute now. Is there some news I should know about? There is definitely no baby right. news. Adam is impotent. I, I am, I'm really sorry to hear about that. Not as sorry as I am. I mean, it's a true story. It's sad. He's, he's, he shoots blanks. But we're, we're going to the, the sperm doctor and we pick some sperm out. You know what, Adam? I changed my mind. Mm, no, I don't think so. Just get off of me. Yes, I did. I changed my mind. Wait, so you don't have kids with me? I physically cannot, because your dick does not work. Why do you gotta be so hurtful to me? Yeah, Is we're that gonna what do you... it right now. We're gonna do it in front we're of your dad. We're doing it right now. Fine, you know what? Yeah, fine. Then I don't want to be with you, Alice Murphy. Consider yourself dumped. Because I'm not just a f toy. I'm a f person. Gotta be fresh. All right, everyone, in the conference room now. Alice, I got your coffee. Uh -huh. oh. Julian, this is ice cold. Like your heart. She is freaking Jeremy Piffed. I wonder if, like, my cool points depleted when I got all that hot sauce in my house last week from the bur burrito, and she must have seen it. Is there something wrong with you people? Because every day this week, someone has come to me bitching and moaning about a new problem. Well, it ends now. Because I don't give a f about your problems. Hear that, Tess? No more coming to my office whining, where my leads at? I don't got no lizzies. I don't sound like that. And Bill, stop coming to me for advice. Why won't girls date me? Maybe because you're broke, because you suck at your job. Ow, burn notice received. You know, Bill, a wig could really help with your confidence. And Gary, stop staring at Jillian. Can't tell if this guy wants to f or kill me. Oh. And now you three want a day off for no reason at all. Actually, that, that'd be great. Thanks. 100% no. If everyone else is here, so are you three idiots. And hey, consider this your lunch break. What? Jillian? You just ate lunch. Yo. Gotta be fresh. Oh, it's point blank, hey, man. Nick you guys are crazy? Nick has no, no! Ow! 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 That broke skin. Ah. Don't oh. slip on this sale because it is really hey, a heater. Uh, how are you? Give me the guns. Uh, the Sold. Buttons. Now. All right, but they're for protection, you know. It's getting dark out there. I don't Let's care, okay? You are at work in an office. Nope. Act like it. This is bull crap. We brought those guns to work fair and square. What the heck, you're like the meanest, most uncaring boss ever. Oh, Blake, I'm so sorry I disappointed you. Get back to work. <gasps> Jillian, come on, let's do this video chat. Well, 2012 was great for us, so I know working with Telemericorp again in 2013 is the right move. Well, that is wonderful. That's exactly what we wanted to hear, Bridget. And I gotta say, it is so wonderful working with a fellow animal lover. Right back at you, Alice. I'll have this contract emailed to you this week. That's great. Beautiful birds, by the way. Oh, well, thank you. Yeah, uh, this one right here, African Grey, wonder of the sky, I always say. I do too. All right, you take care, Bridget. Bye. Ooh, get these goddamn things oh, off of me. Oh, yeah. Oh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Jillian. All right. I know. Jillian. I know. Got him. Oh. I mean, Earth Pets of West Covina, they're such a respectable company. Shut up and give me some skin. <laughs> Ow. Ooh.
Oh, I am so good. And you know what? I am so getting that raise and bonus. Vacay days, girl. <laughs> now, why don't you take these little <laughs> makers back to the store, okay? What? Alice, I handpicked them. I've told them my secrets. They're my best friends. I think you can handle it. And I want receipts. Oh, Hello, I nerds. I need you to fill these out. Oh my gosh, now we have to fill stuff out? You are the meanest person ever. It'll take 10 seconds. Just circle all fives and don't leave any comments. Hang on. This is an evaluation of you? Very good is a five. Very bad is a one. Interesting. And a boss who takes away my work guns is very bad. Like a man who touches kids near their buttholes. That's bad. Oh, that smells exactly like one, what? doesn't it? What? Oh does my smell like one? Oh, yeah, but all ones. Ones. Yeah. Yeah. Like how, about, how about if you give me all fives, I'll give you your guns back. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. Nice. <laughs> and a free day to do whatever we want. All fives. Yes! Yeah, yeah baby! Guys, 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 guys. And on top of that, Ooh, what he yes. hot bread. That's no tough. to what he said, but yes to what I said about yeah. the work guns and the free day. Gotta be first. Ah! Back off, bitches! End of the line, Tez. Drop it. We drop you. Ha ah, ah, ha! Ah. Ha! Nobody move or this boy get pumped full of plastic! I don't have... Shit! Oh! 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 Whoa! That was incredible! You're what my hero. the that was... hell was that crash? Oh my... You guys, I gave you the day off. Travis! I was just coming by to scoop the evaluations and get a look-see at how you do things around here. Now I know. Travis, it, it was just, it was a special occasion. Uh, a deal I made to boost office morale. Oh? And what was the deal? We just had to give her fives. High fives. High fives. Travis, because there is nothing that boosts my morale more than getting some skin. A pie. You're not getting that raise. But no, Travis, I already booked my package to Playa del Carmen. Travis, I, I earned this raise and I deserve this vacation. Then why don't you take the rest of the week off? Hmm? Think things over and hopefully you'll come back sharing my perspective on the situation. And why don't you take the rest of your life to figure out what an asshole you are? Good luck, everyone. Have fun wasting your lives here. Don't cause a scene, Alice. Oh, f off, Travis, and eat a d I quit. Jillian, I want you to pack all my things and bring it to my car. Oh, would you like me to do that? Would you like that? Well, guess what, baby? You're out of here! I think you can handle it, and I want receipts. Jillian, please, just help her. You got it, Travis. Dang, Alice went out like a G. End of an era. I hate to see her go, but I love to stare at her butt as she goes leaving.